Playhouse Disney. Can you guess who's coming next? Here's a hint. The great big book of everything. Do you know who's up next? Barry. He's cool. Of course. Next up is Stanley. Here inside Playhouse Disney. Oh, who is the wonderful one who wants to have fun with Rabbit inside Playhouse Disney? Who is the one who'll be there with a morning to spare and a bunch of carrots to share? Now, who likes Rabbit? <laughs> Make it a habit. And who wants to play? Maybe that who is you. Sing along with the Book of Food today inside Playhouse Disney. Playhouse Disney Live! You see your Playhouse house every morning inside Playhouse Disney. Now, imagine if your Playhouse house could see you! Maybe we should take our show on the road. It's Playhouse Disney Live! An all-new live stage show. Come see Tony and Vivian from out of the box. Welcome to Playhouse Disney Live! Join in the fun and sing, dance, laugh, and play with Pooh and all his friends. PB and J Otter! Roly poly Oli, Bear in the Big Blue House. It's so good to see you. And your new friend's family. Wow. Cool. And if you can, please bring a new or used book for Pooh's Honey Pot Book Drop to donate to local charities. And hey, Playhouse Disney Live could be on its way to a town near you. Go to PlayhouseDisney.com for more information about where you can see Playhouse Disney Live. Come, Come play, play with us. Welcome to Disney's Franken Guy and the Professor. Hello again. I'm the Professor, and this is my pal Franken Guy. <laughs> Poor Frankie's a little chilly down there, so let's warm him up. <laughs> okay, what letter do we need to spell something that will make him all warm and cozy? Use A to spell cat. Spell C A T. Did you say? <laughs> C A T spells cat. Did you say B? The letter B? No, H. Okay, as you wish. The letter B, it shall be. <laughs> Another bad idea. And he's still cold. Now what? H, use H to spell half. H? Well, I don't know. <laughs> All right. H-A-T spells hat. And it looks mighty cozy, I'd say. Whoa. You're welcome, Frank and Guy. And that's all for today. Thanks for all your help. So long. You're inside Playhouse Disney. Here's a song from the Book of Pooh. We're gonna find the answer today. We're gonna search through every letter. think that big people don't need help? Yeah! Really? Well, you know what? You guys just reminded me of, of a story. story! That's right. It's called The Lion and the Mouse, and it goes something like this. One day, a mighty lion who had just eaten a very large meal laid down to take a nap. No sooner was he counting sheep than something or someone tickled his tummy. In a flash, the lion had caught a tiny mouse by its tail. <gasps> Hey, if this story's too scary, I can stop, guys. No! 
Yes. You're sure? Yes. All right, I'll go on. Just as the lion was about to pop the mousy morsel into his mouth, the mouse made an offer. If the lion would let him go, someday he'd do the lion a favor. Well, the lion just had to laugh. What could a creature so small that it wouldn't even make a decent snack do for him? But he really was very full, so he let the little mouse go. Well, some weeks later, the lion was out just prowling around when he stepped on a thorn. The lion roared in pain, but try as he might, he could not pull the thorn from his paw. That's when the mouse came along. And without even being asked, the brave little mouse climbed up on the lion's paw. He wrapped his tiny teeth around the thorn and pulled and pulled until out popped the painful thorn. And that day the lion learned that mighty as he was, there were still some things a tiny mouse could do better. Do you guys like that story? Yeah! That's good because there's something else I need your help with. I need you to help me say goodbye. Are you ready? Goodbye! goodbye. We'll see you next circle time inside Playhouse Disney. Coming up next, have fun with Tony and Vivian on Out of the Box. And after, visit your robot friends on Rolly Poly Oly. Learning is powered by imagination here inside Playhouse Disney. <laughs>